and good day. My name is Jürgen Steinmetz from eTurbo News, and this is a breaking news update. For more news updates and shows, please go to youtube.com slash travel news group, youtube.com slash travel news group. Here's our update. Lufthansa's Health Alliance expands social commitment with 17 new projects. Despite the still noticeable effects of the corona pandemic on project work, Health Alliance is increasing its commitment in Germany and worldwide. The Lufthansa Group's aid organization is now supporting 17 new projects focusing on education, work and income, including for the first time in Argentina, Italy, Iraq, Cameroon, Colombia and the Philippines. As in the past, the projects were selected from suggestions by employees and are supervised and managed by them on a voluntary basis. In total, Health Alliance is now involved in 51 aid projects in 24 countries for disadvantaged young people. The corona pandemic has further exacerbated the global education crisis. That's why there is so much for us to do as an aid organization right now. The new Health Alliance projects are designed to help provide equal opportunities for children and young people after this difficult time. Education is the key to a successful future, says Andrea Pernkoff, Managing Director of Health Alliance. In the Global South, school closures have had a particularly negative impact on the educational opportunities of children and young people. According to the United Nations Children's Fund, UNICEF, insufficient digitization and a lack of equipment prevented at least one-third of students worldwide from learning from home during the pandemic. Through its work, Lufthansa's Health Alliance is making an important contribution to the United Nations Sustainable Development Goals SDGs, of quality education, 4 Sudanese pounds, and decent work and economic growth, 8 Sudanese pounds. Thank you for listening to our news update. There's more on youtube.com slash travel news group. Or you can read us, of course, in going to our news portal at etrobonews.com or travelnews.online.